Oh, baby. Hey, what's up, everybody? How is it going? My name is Oshi Kroser, and I'm here for you guys to play some more Super Mirror Maker. Today, guys, episode number two of Oshi SMM, some levels I pull out of live stream. I heard you guys. I heard you in the last episode. My ears are still ringing. I got it. Okay, let's go. Oh, Oshi, why don't you go to the key door? Oh, Oshi, why don't you get the true ending? Oh, Oshi. Ah, true ending. Ah. I heard you. Let's go. Oh, Oshi, look at you. Oh, why didn't you get the true ending the first? I didn't even see it when I was editing. I seen it in edit. I seen it in edit, okay? Sheesh, you guys. You guys are savage. Look at this, look at this. True ending as fuck, all right? True ending all the way across the sky. We got the truest of endings. Yoshi, have a star, buddy. Yoshi, have a flower, buddy. True ending, baby. I'm locked, locked down, okay? Don't want to hear it again. This does not need to be a meme, all right? Yo, dude, still sick level. Okay, so I'm going to break with you. You guys probably seen it when I first started. Uh, these all have flags on them. A lot of da. Guess what? I screwed up my recording today. I totally goofed it. Um, we're going to recap, uh, maybe not all of them, but we're going to recap some of them. This was a really cool one, and I was kind of dreading it because it's a cape level. But uh, that's okay. This is this is like the dopest cape level ever. Look at this. See? Straight dope. See what I'm talking about? <laughs> okay, let's, let's try it again. Okay. Yo, I love... A, I love the sound effects because I'm the best sound effects maker ever. But also, like, these these flight mechanics are just, like, super awesome, dude. Look at it. Boing, boing. Boing, boing. Oh, here we go. Here we go. And then we Z-trigger up. Right? We're good to go. Life is good. Z-trigger again. Good communication from the, uh, the level creator. Love it a lot. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. And just like that. Okay, I want the checkpoint. I need the checkpoint. Okay, so we go up. Yeah, I was I was really nervous when I when I understood that there was gonna be a cape level. Um, I really don't like cape mechanics because they are not precise. Like they're not precise. I hate precision. Don't get me wrong. I hate precision. However, um, you know the cape mechanics are a little jank. I guess what I'm saying is that there's a lot for interpretation when it comes to like, you know, an auto level like this where, you know, did I jump too early? Did I not jump too early? Like, all a person can do is hold the button down. See, like, we jumped, I don't know, our jump was off a little bit, caused us not to hit the last spring, and screwed it up. So, that's, that's, I mean, and cape precision, and cape levels are usually just flying sucks. I mean, flying a straight line is fun. Probably good this time. Probably good this time. But yeah, this is just so cool. And we'll pull off a Z-trigger. We'll pull off a Z-trigger. Wreck some ghost's face. Right? Pow, pow, pow. Regular jump again. Pop it off. Pop. Love it. So much. I actually like how the ghosts chase us too for a little bit. Okay, we actually pull up a little bit there. And we end up uh, taking that for the win. Let's go. And there was a true ending. I 
know if I needed the helmet for it. I can't remember. I did get it in my first recording. Um, can't remember if... I, it does look like I did get it this time as well. So we're just true ending all over the place today, guys. Oh, Oshi, why don't you get the true endings? True endings out the wazoo. True ending for this is actually down and uh, right in here. Ba 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 True ending, motherfucker, we the greatest. And actually this time, I'm gonna take the spike helmet. I took the wrong helmet last time. We're gonna get the one-ups as, as well, of course. One more star for the road. Let's go. Take the win. Easy peasy. Cool flight level uh, into Stinky Luigi's Mansion. So I liked it. It was a good level. Thank you so much. Okay, so Psycho gave us um, another cape level. So I figured it's good pro progression. Go cape into cape level. This one was a little less. I think we either found some cheese or we found a different way to do it. Um, I'm gonna show you how I did it anyways. That's basically exactly how I started. <laughs> So we were, okay. Um, it looks like there's a setup for us to fly here, but I actually ended up taking this a little bit different and just going, and you can make like a YOLO jump for it. Take it for the win, go through your uh, door and, and profit. Now, you can either fly this way to the end, you can jump off and you'll fly the way that way. Um, but there's also this underground world here and I'm not sure how it was designed for us to handle this. Like, there's no way for you to fly that, so uh, you just, I guess you just got to run it with the cape or something. Um, does take us to the same spot, whether you fly over, there's a bullet bill launcher in the middle of the level, you can fly over. Um, I was a little bit stunned when I came through the very first time, because, um, you know, there's, there's blocks behind the goalpost, and I was big, Mario, and I was like, well, what the heck? Probably spent a good, like, three minutes running, trying to fly out of that middle area there. Didn't make it. Um... I, I didn't make it, so... <laughs> Anyways, it was great level. And I think, actually, I might pop back in one more second. Cause, okay, so just for the conversation of it, this is what you what you actually fly over if you, if you fly, right? Oh, and if you were wondering what was down the left path, literally nothing. Okay, so Rick also gave us a level, said tw it's called Twirly On Them. He says, yo, Oj, it's my only super expert level. Would you play it? I thought, sure. I like twirl levels. I like copter levels. It's great. Um, I actually had a surprisingly hard time with this level. Uh, just getting it, I guess, out of the gates. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. Cute start. I think the, the biggest problem was, is, um, is this part here, and then you go into it. There's also a bit of a, a piece switch jump. Now, I died here a bunch of times because the fireballs are kind of pain in the butt. Mm, what happens here? Oh, okay. We're almost to the end, but that uh, messes a fellow up so much. And basically, I was just like, I basically just soaked my damage there. Honestly, if I could, if I could get it there, this is where I wanted to soak my damage was coming off of here and making that jump there. Because usually, I can land the more often than not, I can I can land the P switch jump, right? But if you can make the P switch jump there without having to come this way, it is so much nicer because then you don't have to uh, die there a hundred times. Yeah, that was why I had a surprisingly tricky time with this. It seemed to me like every time I made it with the mushroom. Oh God. Every time I made it with the mushroom, I could never land my, my P-switch jump. So um, <laughs> I'm just doomed. The time I did beat it, I did beat it with uh, did beat it with my mushroom here. Okay, let's wait. Okay. Whoa, whoa. Okay, let's let's just take this easy. We got time. Huh. Got it. Okay. Hey. <laughs> now I didn't jump in where the star was, as tempting as it was. I still don't know if it's Kaizo blocked off or not. Um, I was super nervous, and I mean that's basically the rule: is if you don't know, you don't go. Right. You don't, you don't want to Kaizo block yourself in, especially after making that P-Switch jump and uh, dodging that treadmill. Ugh. Rick, awesome level, dude. 
I appreciate it. Okay, then we ended our night off with the casual Kaizo by Flybox. I like this level a lot. This is like, I wanna play more levels like this in my future. So if you guys have them like this, I'm always down. I did not make the true endings in this. I will not make the true endings in it this time. Um, as you can see, I have a hard time balancing on a donut platform. That's part of uh, part of my play style. You guys know and love. But um, yeah, I want more levels like this in my future. This this is this is amazing. It's cool Kaizo mechanics, but it's also done in a way where it's. Uh, look at this, yo! Look at this. We get to use this thing twice. Huh! Get a checkpoint. I'm in love. I'm in love. Checkpoint. Do we, do, are we, are we all understood on that? Checkpoint is love. Okay, checkpoint is love. Okay, that's a weird, it's a weird drop, but anyways, we can do it. Okay. Okay. It's gonna take a second. Okay. Seven times the charm. Eight times, oh, I almost got myself on that. Hey, got it. Okay, fall down. Be really careful because I died a lot of times on the spikes there and there's no need to to rush it right there. Whoa. Okay, there's the second key. Now there's a there's a unique true ending in this level where it's like a two-part true ending. Hey, plus we got that. Um It's a neat little two-part true ending here. Oh yeah, see there you go. There's true ending gone, so there's a second checkpoint as well. The, the ultimate true ending is is uh, is two keys. You need both keys to make it through. Uh, if not, you kind of unlock just half of the true ending, which I didn't even unlock half of the true ending, okay? I didn't make any true ending. There's zero true ending finished for this. See, we were so close to. Huh. Okay, there's a second checkpoint, baby. Second checkpoint, baby. Let's talk about you and me. Okay, so we actually come back to this kind of really cool mechanic where we use the same shell mid more than one time. Now, so there goes the true endings; they're all gone. But yeah, I really, I, I, it's just such a cool mechanic. Honestly, God, it's just so cool to be able to like to uh, to recycle like this. I just think it's neat. Because you go one, two, and then the, see, we even need it a third time. See you later. And we even need it a fourth time, I think. <laughs> Yo, regular shell jump after all that shit. Let's go. Ha! Got it. Okay, no. Yeah, so like a two part true ending. Really awesome, really cool, but that's, that is way too much for me to nail it down in one try. I'd probably play this level for like three hours. Nailing it in one single go. I would never be able to upload this. Take me forever. Wow. Oh my God. Yo, we even got a record on it. Great. <laughs> so cool. So cool. I like that level a lot. I want to play more levels like that in the future. So if you guys have really cool levels, lots of checkpoints, kind of tricky mechanics, but you get rewarded with checkpoints after. I dig it. I dig it. I love that. That's that's what my life is about. That speaks to me in a spiritual level. Guys, you got your true ending. We got a couple uh, levels in. Unfortunately, I did screw up the recording. You guys missed a lot of those initial reactions. I'm super sorry. Yo, guys, that's it for today. I just wanted to say thank you guys for your patience with this recording. I know it was a couple days. I missed a couple uploads last week. I talked about it live on stream, and I appreciate your guys' patience. Uh, and thank you guys for watching, of course. You guys have been crazy into this content, and I love it very much. Love seeing all the comments. Love seeing all the reactions, all the shares, all the talk about it. You guys are blowing it up, and I love it. Thank you. Uh, just... A personal deep thank you from me to you guys here at the end of the episode. Again, if you guys want to see me play your levels, pop over on Twitter, use the hashtag OshiSMM, tag me in the tweet, do something clever, you know, get my attention. Um, bonus points if my if my name is in the level. I'm just saying. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, no, I appreciate uh, appreciate all the stuff you guys are going. The, the the hashtag on Twitter is blown up too, so you guys are interested in it. And there's just you know, there's just shows that there's content to be made for you guys so thanks guys have a great day don't forget to stop by twitch.tv slash oshikrosu and catch me live uh sunday through thursday i play a lot of mario makers so hope to see you guys there thanks for watching have a great day i'll see you next time oh, bye, -bye. <laughs>
Yeah.